Carolina Connection Game Highlights, brought to you by Verizon. Miami going left to right, first possession of the ball game for the Hurricanes, no score, third and four. Morris straight back to throw, pressure coming, his pass is intercepted by the Tar Heel. He came near sideline and it was picked off by Dominique Green. All his teammates come to celebrate as Carolina has the football. It shows Dominic Green made a great read on that, but that play was caused by the defensive pressure up front. He is out. No, he is still in. Thought Romar Morris had checked in, but it is still Logan standing to Renner's left. It'll be a play action. Renner drops back, wide open at the 50 as Ebron into Miami territory near side of the 40. Finally bumped out of bounds at the 32-yard line. Give him 20 yards on the pitch and catch. First down, Carolina. Three tailbacks in the game. Play action for Williams. He's going to air it to the end zone and intercepted by the Hurricanes. Tracy Howard picks it off the sophomore corner from Miramar, Florida, was behind the Tar Heel receiver, Bug Howard, and made the grab. Maurice Hagens is the fullback. Hand off to Duke Johnson. He's hit at the five and taken down. Trey Boston again into the backfield for the stop. Third and goal. The holder is the punter, Pat O'Donnell, gets the snap down cleanly, and the kick is up and through. So at the 8.45 mark of the first quarter, Miami takes the lead with the field goal by Goodis. Again, the Heels call this their turbo package. First and 10, Carolina down 3-0. Ball at the 24. Shotgun snap to Williams. Hands off to Logan. Comes near side. Breaks a tackle at the 25. Lowers his shoulder and gets to the 29-yard line. Just as we come back to Keenan Stadium, the Tar Heels go 71 yards for a touchdown as Marquise Williams hits Eric Ebron on a crossing pattern middle of the field. Ebron caught it at just about the 40-yard line, broke a pair of tackles at the 50, and then Ethan, he was gone down the far sideline. Third and 10, Miami, three on the play clock, gets the snap, play action, Morris. Has time to throw, he's gonna air it out deep. A bunch of bodies there, caught behind the Tar Heel defense by Philip Dorsett. He takes it all the way down to the seven yard line. A huge play. Miami going left to right. Morris in the shotgun, third and goal. He'll bring pressure, flush him near side. Morris to the end zone, incomplete. Schottmer, the man applying pressure right up the gut of the line and Miami's gonna have to try another field goal. This will be a 20-yard attempt by Gudis. He made a 22-yarder earlier this quarter. Snap back, spot down, kick is up, and it is good. Right now, explosive plays hurting the Tar Heels on defense. Miami has a 59-yarder and a 68-yarder. Alex Mars, the deep snapper. Remember, Connor Fry was injured last week. And the kick is blocked and then picked up by Miami. The Hurricanes are gonna take it all the way for a score. Ladarius Gunter picks up the blocked field goal and takes it for the touchdown. Artie Burns, the man who made the block. Carolina just two for six on third down as Renner gets the shotgun snap. Over the middle, Ebron in double coverage, makes the grab and has the first down at a 20 yard line. Deion Bush and Rayshon Jenkins collided. They're still on the field as the Heels hustle down to try to get out of the playoff. A.J. Blue in the backfield, standing to Renner's right. Miami will rush just four. Renner has time to throw near side of the end zone for a touchdown. Quinshot Davis for six. Boy. He did a great job getting behind the Miami defense. They looked like they had a little miscommunication there, and he slipped right in behind it. Nice touch by Bryn Renner just to lay it in right over top of Ladarius Gunner. Four receivers in the formation for Miami. Three near side, one to the far. Ball on the far hash as the Canes go right to left. 7.47, first half, heels up by one. Carolina with a lot of pressure in the pass, pick off. Boston has it at the 10. Comes near sideline, 25, trade to the 30. Still on his feet, wrestled down at the 32. There are flags down, but I think, and let me stress this, think it is a hold on Miami. 
Marquise Williams, play action, back to pass, drops it off over the middle, Ebron again has the first down, leaping over the 30 near the 25 yard line to the 26, a gain of 12 for the first down. Snap is back, spots down, kick is up, and it is good. So Thomas Moore converts the field goal this time and stretches out the Tar Heel lead. Morris in the shotgun. Crawford, the sophomore from Fort Myers, Florida to his right. Play action to Crawford. Morris chased and bring down. Kareem Martin takes him down all the way back at the 40-yard line. A loss of 14 yards on the sack. Snap down. Kick is away. And it is no good. Missed it to the right. Carolina pacing, by that I mean moving quickly. Shotgun snap to Renner, play action. Airs it, middle of the field, Ebron, one-handed grab at the 50 for the first down. He does something spectacular every single week. And he gets up off the ground, hands the ball to the official like he's done it before, it's lining up for has. the next play. Renner in the shotgun, second and six. Quick screen to Switzer, far side. Switzer gets a block at the 40, first down, middle of the field now to 35, taken down at the 31 yard line, give him 14. He's made one and had one block today. Snap is back, spot is down, kick is up, and it is good for Thomas Moore. The Tar Heels stretch the lead to a touchdown at 20 to 13. The eight players who play on the O-line for Miami average 6'6", 319. Morris in the pistol. He'll hand off to a new back in the game. It's Gus Edwards. They call him Gus the Bus. He had a flat tire on that one as he was hit at the line of scrimmage by Jack Tab. Tar Heels rush four. Morris sets up the screen, throws it. It hits off the back of the helmet of his offensive lineman, and it's intercepted. Norkeithis Otis picked it off. It bounced off the helmet of Centrell Henderson up in the air and it's a pick you don't see that every day <laughs> second and two shotgun snap renner to logan first down and more 35 40 logan middle of the field knocked down at the 42 yard line took a big hit after he gained 14 yards he'll get the snap he has blue with him this time he'll throw again drops it off over the middle caught at the 45 tarios it's howard or excuse me quinshot davis over the 40 for another first down. Now Tommy Hibbert is up and barking out some signals. Now he'll crouch back down. Actually set up a yard farther back on the second crouch to the 12 yard line. Snap back, spot down, kick up, and it's good. Thomas Moore with his third field goal of the night. This one comes at the 14-17 mark of the fourth quarter. Miami going right to left. Here in the fourth quarter, Morris again, they'll feed Crawford and this time nothing. He is set down in the backfield by Kareem Martin. Back at the 46 yard line, a loss of two. Morris under center, the true eye behind him is Crawford at the back end. Play action from Morris, some pressure in his face. Boy, wide open is tight end at the 40. Nobody near him down the far sideline. It is Clive Walford all the way to the 20 yard line. There was no one within 20 yards of Clive Walford when he cut the, caught the ball. It is first and goal from about the three and a half. Morris hands off to Crawford, far side of the line, breaks a tackle and gets into the end zone. The first offensive touchdown of the day for Miami. Remember their other score came on a blocked field goal return. Morris in the shotgun, two receivers stacked on top of each other to either side. He will get the snap and drop back to throw. Flushed out of the pocket, far side. Being chased by Otis. Morris finally out of his hands. And there, no! Knocked away, or was it picked off? It was! Dominique Green had it, juggled it, and got it back again for the fourth interception of the ball game. 8.24 and counting, both teams with all three timeouts. Heels going to the air on this one. Renner short over the middle. Caught by Thorpe, makes a man miss. Comes to the near sideline, tight ropes the sideline, all the way down to the 31 yard line. TJ Thorpe caught that middle of the field at the 50 and somehow made it 19 yards down the field. Carolina play action and a pump fake from Renner. Stands in the pocket, airs it out, picked off at the 10 yard line 
as Renner throws a crucial interception. Hibbert, back to punt. Gets a really good one away. Hits at the 10 and goes out of bounds at the nine. A 55 yard punt for Tommy Hibbert. What a boot for the Tar Heel kicker. It will be officially out at the 10 yard line and two receivers set out wide right. Another handoff, a lot of room, Clements into the secondary. He's at the 50 before taking down there. Miami just pounding it at the Tar Heels. Second and eight, Morris in the shotgun. He'll put it in the air, caught by Hearns, knocked out of bounds right at the first down marker at the 41. Morris under center, Crawford the only man behind him. They send a man in motion. Handoff to Crawford, he's up, ended, but into the end zone for the touchdown. Just 16 seconds left as Miami barks at the student section after going 90 yards for a touchdown. Miami will rush three. They have five players lined up at about the 23 yard line and three players in the end zone. Shotgun snap to Renner. He's flushed, he'll air it out. Here we go, ball in the end zone is incomplete. Carolina had a hand on it. Quinshot Davis had a hand on the ball but could not hold on as the Tar Heels suffer a devastating loss to Miami tonight.